Welcome back. Thank you for staying with CNN News 18. We're having some breaking news that's coming in. Now, wrestler Antim Panghal's big charge against the Wrestling Federation of India. He ha she has said that uh, Vinesh Fogart has been given direct entry for Asian Games despite that she has not been uh, practiced for past one year. Uh, I won gold medal in the 2022 Junior World Championship. Even in the Commonwealth Games trials, I had a 3-3 bout with her. Then too, I was cheated. Should I quit wrestling? All I want is a fair trial. I'm not saying that only I can defeat her. There are many women wrestlers out there who can do so. This, so this is what uh, wrestler Antim Pangal is claiming, who is clearly upset uh, and is asking for a fair selection trial after Wrestling Federation of India ad hoc panel announced that uh, um, Vinesh Fogart will get direct entry into the Asian Games. So now uh, Antim Pangal is upset with the decision as she also participated in the same category uh, as Vinesh and she claims that she also performed well in the same category as Vinesh did. CNN News 18's Nikhil Lakwani is joining us on this story. Nikhil, can you tell us more about uh, what exactly is the matter? Well, actually, as far as the details are concerned, we have been given to understand that Vinesh Hogart uh, has been uh, has been given direct entry for the Asian Games, despite that she has not uh, practiced uh, practice for past one year. And this is something which has not gone down well with the fellow wrestlers who have been working tirelessly for many months and for many years. And now there's this one wrestler, Antim Pangal. She has come out in the public domain. She has issued a media bite as well, where she has said that the equal opportunity should have been given to all the stakeholders. She has said that despite Vinesh not practicing for more than a year, she has been given direct clearance uh, to participate in the Asian Games. And this is something which is very much unfair. Whereas I have performed very well in last many of the games. Uh, so what should I do? Should I quit wrestling? So this is uh, something which has been alleged by the fellow wrestlers and Antin Pangal is the first one to raise concerns about the same. But as for the details, uh, as mentioned earlier as well, and that Finish Fogart, uh, she has been given direct entry in the Asian Games. And also, uh, this is something which we are learning from the sports ministry, uh, sports ministry sources, is, is that uh, at the start of the month of July, both Pajdang Punia and Vinesh Fogart, they have been sent for the uh, training in different countries. Uh, Bajan Punia is currently in Kyrgyzstan and uh, Vinesh Kogart, uh, she, uh, she had uh, gone to Bishkek and then she was supposed to be in a uh, hungry country for the further practicing. So this is something which has not gone down well and uh, let's see how this is also going to be seen from the other wrestlers who have not spoken so far in the public domain. Anshti. All right, Nikhil, please stay with us. Let's listen in to what uh, Antip Pangal has to say on the matter. ये नहीं कि मैं ही मैं रहूंगी और भी बहुत लड़कियां प्रैक्टिस कर रही है जबकि इन्होंने एक साल से प्रैक्टिस नहीं की है अब तो यहां से ये चले जाएंगे बोल रहे हैं हम चले जाएंगे लेकिन आगे क्या मेडल आ जाएंगे ऐसे इनके ये थोड़े तो हम भी क्या हम पहलवानी छोड़ दें We have uh, CNN News 18's Shivani Gupta joining us on this story. Shivani, help us understand how has Vinesh Fugard been given direct entry to the Asian Games? Well, that's the billion-dollar question, not just Vinesh, but Bajrang Punia, two of the wrestlers uh, who were protesting against Bridgepushan Sharan in the entire um, Wrestlers versus Federation episode. They've been granted direct entry. Now, as far as the WFI ad hoc committee circular released yesterday is concerned, that which we have an access to, it doesn't quite name them, but it becomes clear as far as their category is concerned that they are being given direct entry. And I spoke to one of the members of the ad hoc committee as well. So this is going to be a big question that will be raised on the ad hoc committee. Right now, there are no elected members who are in charge of the WFI. Remember, after Bridge Bhushan, Sharon was asked to step aside and the inquiry was initiated against him. The sports ministry had pushed IOA to institute an ad hoc committee to run the day-to-day -day affairs of the WFI. 
which includes selections and trials for the upcoming Asian Games. Now, it's going to be a big question mark on to what basis uh, the ADO committee has decided that two of the wrestlers who were protesting against the government should be given a direct entry to the Asian Games. And it's not surprising. Antim Pangal may have become the first one to do so, but there will be others, for, even in the category of Bajrang Punia, for example, Sujid and others, who may feel they have a shot at becoming the entrance for, from India for the Asian Games, who may also raise objections on this. So it will be important on the part of the ad hoc committee that is being led by a former judge to explain the reasons behind this decision because it seems like a series of bad mistakes that are being made as far as this entire episode is concerned. And you would remember that Vinish Pogat had come under scanner when this, when this entire protest had started for saying in front of the media that she will not play the trials and she will go